that'll get you going in the morning. It's Hispanic Heritage Month, and this morning we're learning more about the tradition that has continued across generations, the quinceanera. The quinceanera is such an important milestone in a young girl's life, and while it's rooted in Latin America history, it has remained a strong tradition for the families in the U.S. A quinceanera is an unforgettable day. 15 years, yeah. A celebration of a girl's 15th birthday, signifying her entrance into womanhood. <laughs> the history of the quinceanera dates back to the 1500s, but is still popular today in Mexico, South America, as well as here in the United States. Initially, it was meant that she's no longer a little girl. It's time for her to put away childish things and be introduced into society. Josephine Torres' family has owned Azteca Bridal in Phoenix for decades, providing dresses for thousands of quinceañeras. Back in the 1950s, they only offered wedding dresses. But after her Tia Royna's big 15th birthday celebration, they knew they needed to expand. The first one in the family, and then the first one at, from the school that was going to have a quinceañera. So because of that, my nana and tata decided, okay, well, we need a quinceañera dress now. And so that's how it began. And then the next young lady decided she needed to have a quinceanera. And then the next one decided she needed to have a quinceanera. And so slowly but surely the business grew. We added the quinceanera boutique. The family tradition continues as Tia Royna's granddaughter, Sofia, prepares for her big day. Since my nana owns a quinceanera shop, I want to try on almost every day. <laughs> Initially, it was a significance of purity, so the gowns were all white. But now, more modern, we want color, as you can see. Um, it's all about color now. So how does one decide on the best dress for such an important event in life? I think it's kind of like when you put it on, you know, and it's, this sounds so, so cheesy, but it's super true. I looked at myself and I was like, wow, I look great in this. I feel like a princess, to be quite honest. It's about culture, it's about traditions. The process itself is very special to me. It, it holds a sacred place in my heart. 